Today I'm going to teach you how to rotate an image in Photoshop. It's rather simple. All you have to do is, first off, you want to double click on your layer from the Layers panel and press OK. That'll just enable this uh, layer to be, um, well, to be rotated. So, let's create a new layer under this layer. Let's push Control, hold Control, and press the Create New Layer button. That'll create a new layer under this layer instead of above it. And to fill this with black, I'm just going to press Alt Backspace. And uh, because my foreground color is black, Alt Backspace filled that layer with black. If I disable the top layer, you can see that it's black. So now we're going to click on our top layer and press Control T. That'll bring up the free transform menu. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hold Alt and Shift and drag the corner, the top corner, or any of the corners, inward. And that'll keep the proportion by holding Alt and Shift and drag it to, you know, wherever you want. And now if you're outside of the uh, image, you can see these little arrows. Your mouse turns into little uh, arrows twisting. That's that's how you rotate. All you have to do is rotate it, you know, from side to side as much as you want. And press OK when you're finished, and you have a rotated image. This works really well with frames. So to teach you how to make a frame, for this rotation, I'm going to make this an extended tutorial. I'm just going to control click on this. That'll select this image. I uh, control clicked on this layer. That, that makes a selection around this image. Now I'm going to create a new layer above this layer. It still has that selection. And I'm going to go up to the select menu, modify, and I'm going to expand. And I'm going to expand, let's go 20 pixels. Now you can see that the selection got a little bit wider. I want it more than that though. I'm going to modify, expand. I'm going to make this time 40 pixels. That's 60 pixels in total. See, now we have a lot larger selection. So what we're going to do now is push control backspace. That filled this, um, this selection with white. Now we're just going to drag this layer under this layer the top layer under the flower layer and we have a nice little frame right there all that simple hope you enjoyed this thanks for watching